Hey, I'm Brad, I'm a designer and I'm based in Epping, Victoria. What prompted me to get the scooter? I had a fall at work about two years ago. I was diagnosed with epilepsy and that led to a diagnosis of cancer. With that, I lost my license. Losing my license uh, wasn't an option and I wanted to still get around. I wanted to get to work, I wanted to go to the gym. Being told I lost my license for six months was a real kick in the guts, given that I hadn't done anything wrong. It was just a medical incident. So yeah, it felt a little bit unfair and I was basically trying to work out how I was still gonna be able to get around. That's when I started looking for the scooters and it's been fantastic. So deciding on an, a scooter at the time, I needed to have the confidence to be able to get from A to B. From home to work is around eight kilometers. And in between that, I have a gym. So I needed something with a lot of muscle. When I started researching electric kicks, I spoke to a couple of the guys there and they assured me that a couple of their models were really, really good for that type of trip. I didn't know what type of scooter I wanted at the time, but electric kicks made it so easy for me to understand what type of scooter I needed. So once I made the decision that I wanted a scooter from electric kicks, the process that I went through was really, really easy. And a couple of the guys there, especially Luke, made the process really easy for me to purchase the scooter. Once I'd made that decision to purchase the Apollo, the aftercare and all the communication from the time that I purchased it right through to the end was amazing. I found that from a customer's point of view, also working in marketing, that the communication from purchase right through was fantastic. They told me when it was at the warehouse, when it was leaving, and also followed up with a call to make sure that I was happy with my purchase. So that was really fantastic. Really important knowing that I can get a service, I can call up Electric Kicks and get it sent straight to their workshop. That's really reassuring that I can get it serviced because I need the scooter every single day to get to work and get to the gym and whatever. So that is really, really reassuring. When all this happened to me with the cancer and the epilepsy, I was pretty devastated. For one, because of those diseases, but two, I'd lost my freedom. Getting the scooter has given me back my freedoms, given me back my ability to go to work every day, go to the gym, go to the supermarket, whatever it is. I couldn't thank Electric Kicks enough. They've been fantastic. Their service has been amazing. They've given me my freedom back and I would recommend them to anybody.